Hello everyone, good morning, welcome back to another video today. I am going to be potentially ruining my hair and I thought you might like to watch me do it. So this all started about a few weeks ago. I did a Q&A and I said in that Q&A, I kind of want to dye my hair a dark blue. Then I said the good old, if this video gets 10,000 thumbs up, oh, I did not say it like that at all. If this video gets 10,000 thumbs up, I will film a video of me dyeing my hair blue, doing it all myself. Yeah, the video got more than 10,000 thumbs up. Honestly, I didn't think it would. Can we please get this video to over 10,000 thumbs up as well? Because like, this is the one where I'm actually doing it. This one deserves the love. Give this video all the love you have. <laughs> Just give it a thumbs up, please. Thanks. I bought two hair dyes and I'm hoping at least one of them will work. They both claim to work on brown hair. So I thought, amazing, I don't have to strip the brown out of my hair first because if anyone's new here, this isn't even my natural hair color. Like my natural hair is a dark blonde. I then bleached it for about 10 years. So I had quite a bright blonde hair color. And then last year I started dyeing my hair brown. So I guess if it doesn't work, I could strip the brown out of my hair and try again. But I'm gonna try and do it without out having to do all of that because I can't be asked if I'm honest I can't be bothered <laughs> anyway I have rambled on for long enough let's go and dye my hair can we all do this for me everybody do this <laughs> that's the ugliest thing I've ever seen <laughs> So this is the first hair dye that I'm gonna be using. It's the Swazkoff Urban Metallics Live Intense Color <laughs> Permanent Permanent Okay, I've just looked up some of the reviews. Turns out it's absolute shit, so I don't think this is even gonna work, but I looked at the reviews. It says it's permanent, but it's not. It washes out quite quickly, so it's all good. Okay, so this is the one that I've got. It's in the shade Blue Mercury. How beautiful does that color look? Like, it looks amazing, but the reason I went for it is because it says it works on brown hair, so obviously my hair is probably this kind of shade. Oh, I've got chipped nail. Let me do it with this one. Oh no, oh no, have we got any that aren't chipped? <laughs> This is the hair colour that I have at the moment, I'm pretty sure. So I would absolutely love it if my hair turned that shade. I just, I just don't think it will, you know? I feel like that's too good to be true. <laughs> Should we dye your hair blue? Let's just get on with it. Let's say goodbye to this brown hair. Let's go and make it look blue. <laughs> so obviously the first thing I need to do is take my bun out. My hair is going to be a mess. Just prepare yourselves. It is going to be an absolute mess under this bun because it's been in a bun for quite a while. Prepare yourselves. Oh no, I've probably got about 5,000 bobby pins in here. This could take a while. What was that? One, two, mm, 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 mm. Mm -mm. Okay, I think that's all of them. I think we're good. Oh. Okay, so I've already done my allergy test. It's so important to always do an allergy test before you dye your hair because hair dye reactions can be so dangerous. Oh goodness, cat, you cannot be there. You can't sit in your sink. Squeeze the entire contents into the developer lotion bottle. Carefully squeeze. I can't promise I'll do it carefully, but I can squeeze. Okay, I'm squeezing carefully. It's gonna take me a while. God, it's stiff. I'll be back in a minute. Shake vigorously. Oh, is that on yet? Is that vigorous enough for you? Wow. Is anyone's hand actually that big? Okay, okay, it's already turning blue. I'm just gonna start squirting it. Oh. Um, I think there's a little thing you gotta take off first. Okay, now it should actually come out. <gasps> oh, hi. Okay, I think it's going quite well so far. It's definitely going slightly blue already, but it's weird though, because the dye is this kind of color. It's like a really light pastel blue. I thought by now, because it's developed quite a lot by now, I thought it would be a much darker blue, so that doesn't fill me with much hope, but I'm just hoping it's going to get darker and darker as time goes on. I mean, it should, shouldn't it? So the hair dye is now on my head. Please excuse how crazy I look right now. I've just kind of piled all of my hair onto the top of my head. And yeah, I've got to wait 30 minutes. I might leave it a little bit longer just in hope that it shows up better. So I might leave it for like 45 minutes and then I guess we'll rinse it off. I managed to get it off my skin really easily, which I'm so happy about 
about. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it for 30 minutes and then I will get back to you and we'll see how it's looking. I'm hoping it's gonna look a little more of a dark blue because like right now it's really not developed that much at all, but hopefully it will develop over the next half an hour. So it's been on for about 45 minutes and I'm not really seeing any blue. Don't know about you, but I don't see any blue. Um, I'm pretty sure it's just dyed my hair black, which is not really what I was going for. I don't know, I think it's dyed my hair black. I really do. I'm gonna go and rinse it off now and then we'll see how it looks, but I don't have high hopes for this. I think we're gonna have to whack out the other one. <laughs> I am so glad I got more than one hair dye to try because as you can see my hair is not blue at all like it is still exactly the same as it was before it's definitely not blue is it like there is no blue in my hair so that was a massive fail I'm thinking maybe my hair was a little bit too dark I'm now going to try again but with the other hair dye that one better work otherwise this video is going to be a bit of a letdown <laughs> this is the Manic Panic semi-permanent hair color cream and it's in the shade after midnight which is the darkest blue one that they did it looks like quite a navy blue which as you guys know that is what i'm wanting so yeah it seemed to have good reviews this one i actually checked the reviews on this one but the negative reviews were that it is so messy apparently it stains your skin it stains your clothes it stains your bath like i am a little bit nervous about using this one that is why i was hoping the other one would work so i didn't have to whack this out but let's let's hope this works i really hope it does so it's basically just this really thick really thick creamy texture um yeah like it is really thick i love how in the other one i was all joking and this one i'm really serious because i'm scared um i think i'm gonna do this off camera because i just want to focus on covering my hair but not getting it on my face not getting it anywhere i'll be back once my hair is covered and we'll see what it looks like so here i am again looking absolutely delightful with hair dye on my head i always look awful at this point because i just pile it on my head nah it's not a good look but this is what it's looking like. I feel like if I go into the light, I feel like it definitely looks a little bit more blue compared to last time. So I think this time it might work. Hello everyone, it is now the next day. I'm about to show you guys the finished result. I've dyed my hair. Oh my goodness, it was quite the drama. I have a story to tell you, but this is what my hair is looking like. Oh my goodness, what a process. That was. I thought, yeah, nice and easy, rub it on, wash it off, done, Bob's your uncle. Nah. -uh. We were doing this, I say we, because I did it when Alex got home in the end, because I knew I'd need a bit of help. We were doing this for hours, like, oh my god. So last time I saw you, I just put the hair dye on and I left it on for about an hour. And then I went to rinse it off. I did it over the bath. So I like put my head over the bath and Alex tried to rinse it off. And oh my goodness, blue went everywhere. The bath is blue. I'll show you guys in a minute how our bath is looking. It's blue. Um, <laughs> okay, let's be real. The bath isn't that stained. I'm sure I could get that out with some cleaning products, but yeah, that's what it's looking like now. It just kind of gathered in these bits and it stained them blue, but I'm pretty sure I will be able to get that out. And the worst thing was after we'd rinsed out the dye, we'd shampooed my hair, all of that, my scalp was electric blue i kid you like i can't even explain how bright like imagine the brightest blue you've ever seen in your life my scalp was bright blue and then i had this like dark blue hair i don't even know where that color came from because nothing was that color but my scalp was bright blue i'm gonna insert a clip now of the towel that we used to scrub my scalp just so you can see the color okay the camera isn't even showing how bright this is but this is the color that my scalp was. Like my entire scalp was this bright blue. And I think it's safe to say, I'm gonna have to bin my towel now because there are little blue patches like this. I say little, that's a pretty big patch. There are big patches like this all over it. And yeah, I think we've got to say goodbye to my pink towel. I need to get another one. So you can just picture the situation right now. It's sort of like half 10, getting on for 11 o'clock right now. And there we are, sat in the bathroom. Alex is scrubbing my scalp with a towel with a load of like, washing up liquid because I googled how to get hair dye out of your scalp and it said washing up liquid so he's like scrubbing my scalp with washing up liquid and <laughs> it was just like I'm laughing now but at the time I was stressed because I was like I've read reviews saying that this does not come out of skin am I gonna have an electric blue scalp for the rest of my life <laughs> it was everywhere like it was just blue everywhere everywhere i turned i saw blue alex has stained fingertips his fingers are still blue i managed to get it out of my hands but he hasn't so yeah 
but I am really happy with the colour. It's just like a very dark, would you say it is a navy blue? Because navy blue is what I was going for and I feel like there are parts that look kind of like a navy blue. Again, just ignore the roots. Yeah, I am actually really happy with the colour. I think I like it. I thought I hated it, but the more I look at it, I think I like it. I like it more on camera. I'm not gonna lie, in real life it looks worse. <laughs> So this is what it looks like in the natural light. As you can see, it's just a really dark, bluey kind of colour. I don't even really know, but I'm actually happy with it. I like it the most in natural light. I think this just looks like a really cool colour. So yeah, I am happy with it. I don't hate it as much as I did last night. Last night I was like, Alex, I hate it. Today it's grown on me. I think I quite like it. It does look like a blacky kind of grey colour, doesn't it? But then you can just see the hints of blue. So I don't really know. It basically looks different in different lights like it changes all the time but i don't really care i'm happy with it it's all good <laughs> i'm trying to like hide my roots look you can still kind of see it i'm trying to like hide my roots by giving myself a big fringe like oh my goodness this is like going back to teenage sophie but oh i don't know i don't know what i'm doing i'm just messing it up now anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was probably not the most interesting video it was literally just me dyeing my hair twice but i hope you found some kind of enjoyment out of it i promise my next video will be something a little more creative than just me dyeing my hair but let me know what you think of it yeah please let me know comment down below if you think this looks good or if you think it looks awful please let me know down below what you think of it give this video a big thumbs up like give it all the thumbs you have because it was a process and <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye.